Hi guys, my name is Phil Santo. I'm originally from Southern California. I grew up in a home with loads of dysfunction and no ties to the church. Even though my parents did the very best that they could with what they were given, I ended up experiencing uh, abuse of many kinds, uh, abandonment, going in and out of group homes and foster care. Um, I ended up experiencing rejection at the age of 15. I was uh, uh, basically out on the streets on my own, uh, living and trying to figure out life. This led to addiction. It led to mental illness. Uh, it led me actually to a time where I fought thoughts of suicide continually. At the age of 19, I reached out to a church called Calvary Chapel. I spent the next 10 years going in and out of faith, though, struggling back and forth until the age of 29. I cried out to God in frustration over my life. That's when God revealed himself to me. I'd like to share that story with you a little bit. Um, in all honesty, if I'm being transparent, um, I was so frustrated that I had both fists up at God with one finger uh, up at him. And uh, it wasn't a good one. But in God's grace and mercy, literally, as I was crying out to him saying, I've tried everything that I can to please you. Even though I was rebelling against him in that moment, I heard a soft, still voice speak to me. And he said, that's what I've been waiting for, for you to realize that you can't do this on your own. Now, let me show you my strength in you. Within six months of that experience, uh, I was called into the ministry of a two year school full time. Um, it was a, a school for pastoral training through Calvary Chapel. Since then, I've planned to help plant many churches with friends and um, I've uh, also during that time, and, and they were doing, they're doing great today, by the way. Uh, but in that process, my wife and I also have experienced a lot of church hurt. God has used every one of those experiences, however, in a radical way to shape my wife and I's heart for people. Most importantly, he taught us about his faithfulness during that season. So no matter what background you come from or what you've been through, I know that Wounded for War will be a place where you'll be accepted and able to grow together on this journey that God has us on. Hey, thank you for watching this and I hope to see you soon.